Hey guys, I hope you're all doing well. Welcome to another video. For today's video, I'm going to show you step by step how you can be able to recover any deleted photo on iPhone. It's not something difficult. I'm going to show you step by step how you can do it. And it's not going to take you like a long time, just a few minutes, and you're going to be able to recover any deleted photo. So now I'm going to my phone so I can show you step by step how you can do it. And as you can see here, photos recovery, that's the app that we're going to use for today's video so we can recover our photos on iPhone. So I'm going to open it so I can show you how it works. Okay, so here I have recover plus plus button. All I need to do is to click on it. And as you can see, guys, I just recovered all my photos on iPhone. And that's really insane. You can do the same thing just by following what I'm going to tell you today and what I'm going to sh share with you. Okay, so I'm going to uh, get out now from uh, this app. And what you need to do now first, which is to make the changes that I'm going to show you right now on settings. So let's go to settings and open it. And let's go to general background up refresh and background up refresh again and make sure that uh, the background up refresh is on Wi-Fi or Wi-Fi and mobile data not off okay so for me I'm gonna keep it on Wi-Fi let's go back to settings and let's go to battery and make sure that the low power mode is off not on but off so if it's on like this turn it off okay now let's go to app store and let's go to automatic downloads and make sure that it is on. If it's off, turn it on like this. So I'm gonna keep it on. And yeah, we're done now with settings. We can get out from it. Okay, so now we're done with settings and I'm gonna show you right now what you need to do next. So just keep on watching. So what you need to do is to go to this website and follow all the instructions in order to get your app. And as I told you guys, it's not something difficult. Just follow these steps and you're going to be able to get your app. And this was the video. I hope it was useful to you and see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.